Since 1981 in South Florida, Young Arts has identified exceptional young artists with great potential and invested in their creativity through funding, mentorship, and a whole lot more. And every year, thousands of high school students from the ages of 15 to 18 from all around the country compete in their disciplines. The winners then come here to perform. CBS4's Lisa Petrillo walks us through day one. Whether it's jazz, ballet, Temporary dance, voice, visual arts, and more. National Young Arts Week celebrates the best and brightest of young artists ages 15 to 18 from around the U.S., from 10 disciplines, as they all rehearse and perform here in Miami. Pianist and composer Clive Chang, formerly of the Lincoln Center, is now president of Young Arts this year. These wonderful young artists who come from 26 states um, all participated in a national competition and have been selected um, out of over 7,000 applications. These are the top 138 and um, this is a chance for us to showcase them, to celebrate their talent and their craft, and also to allow them to take the next step. Big names such as Viola Davis, Kerry Washington, Josh Groban, and Timothy Chalamet are all Young Arts alumni. For the next five nights, these exceptional young artists will perform here in town. Rehearsals were underway today, both in voice and in dance. Here at Miami City Ballet, dancers Joshua Armstrong, age 17, from Tampa, and 18-year-old Jocelyn Wynn from Rochester, New York, are fine-tuning their routines under expert supervision. So I think this uh, program is amazing for people of our age because it allows us to start networking at such a young age and I know that these friends we meet this week will be like lifelong friendships and connections. There's so many different and amazing unique people here in all of the arts so if you're not familiar with one you can like check out a different one and it's just beautiful all around. 17-year-old Sam Fine from Miami, whose moves took our breath away, has dreamed to dance on Broadway one day. He says he's thrilled Young Arts is based here in his hometown. It's amazing to like know that my mom can come and watch me dance and like do what I love. And I think that's like, like a really big perk, you know, because some people aren't able to have their family here. And I think it's crazy that my mom can watch me dance at this amazing like Young Arts organization. And just, it's really awesome. National Young Arts Week is on through Friday with most of the performances down the beach at the New World Center. Or you can go for free online as they will stream it live. Go to our website at cbsmiami.com. Bright futures here for all. I'm Lisa Petrilla. CBS 4 News. Just extraordinary. All that talent here in South Florida. Stars born right here every day.